You know, I'm liking this little live thing. Everything is everything. I'm here in New York City. Just felt like I'd hop on for a minute. Let me see if I can turn y'all around. See these buildings. Yes. That's where we are. You know, it's a special day. It's International Women's Day, but to me, every day is the day of the woman. <laughs> right? Because that's what we're here to do. We're here to lift each other up. No matter who we are, men and women, women are here to lift up men. Men are here to lift up women. Women are here to lift up women. Whiffed up? I don't want whiffed up. I want to lift up. <laughs> so that's what we're here for. So I was just thinking that we could check in for a minute and just like celebrate each other. Get some real good energy flowing. Are you with me? Hi, girlfriend. <laughs> Hi, Misty. What's up? You know what I mean? Let's see. Who are some of the most incredible women in your life? Like that really stand out to you. For me, I'm always thinking about my Nana. She is like, she taught me so much. She taught me how to be elegant. She taught me how to be loving. She taught me how to be powerful and strong and not take no shit. You know, I'm always thinking about her. I'm always thinking about my mother. Definitely, she's a single mother, raised me by herself in this crazy mean city. You know, she's another one taught me not to take no shit. <laughs> and I was just thinking that, um, you know, it's just, it's super, it's super beautiful to just lift, think of all the people that have, you know, lifted us up. Like they taught me how to be a woman. And I was thinking that, I was thinking that in so many ways, even though, you know, there's still plenty of inequities and there's plenty of, you know, gender inequities that need to get sorted out. I was thinking that these women in my life have always showed me that I'm capable, you know, I'm able and that I, 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 I'm just as intelligent, if not more than anybody else, you know, as, as our equal counterparts. So I love that. You know what I mean? I just was thinking about them. Who are you thinking about today? Which women in your life are just like magnificent and just have given you something? Okay. I see your aunt Tracy. Yes. Blessings to aunt Tracy. You know what I mean? Oh, you know who else for me? My godmother. I was, yes, look, you just said your godmother, how to stand your ground, know your self-worth and self-love, you know, cause I was just thinking about my godmother too. Cause she, she, um, was so incredible as well. She was vivacious and, you know, had really incredible energy. And she was always like, just somebody you wanted to be around. She has such a beautiful light around her. And I think that I picked that up from her to kind of like, being silly and being able to just have a good time. And also as a woman, being beautiful and being unafraid of our beauty and our diversity, how, how different we can be. And that is all beautiful. You know, we don't have to all look the same, be the same, do the same thing. You know what I mean? Wear the same thing. We can be unique. And I think she really taught me also how to be unique. Who else? Let me see. I see Keisha said her mother and was just such a strong woman and, and happy. Happy International Women's Day to her. Thank you, thank you so much. And love from Africa, yes, I love you, for sure. And from Autumn's Way, that's a blessing. Thank you so much. Yes, Erica Badu, I agree. You know what I, what my favorite thing about Erica Badu is she's such an artist and she has her opinions and she has she has her style and what she feels, what she represents, and, and she's herself, like 100% herself. There's not a day that I've seen her that she's not truly authentically herself, and I love that about her. So shout out to Erica Badu. Shout out to Janelle Monet. I love me a Janelle Monet so much. Again, just incredible energy, um, you know, just being able to, once again, stand on her own two feet, make music, in her own style, she has her own lane. There is nobody in her lane, you know what I mean? And I just, I just love that. You're talking about your grandmother and your aunts and you've had so many women mentors and role models. I think that's incredible. You know, um, your best friend, 
who stayed with you 23 years. That's incredible. Wow. Blessings to you. I see everybody who is just, just spreading love to the women that have inspired them. I was reading to my kids yesterday about um, about some incredible women as well, um, like Mae Jemison. Um, I was I was I was reading them this super cool book, and Egypt was like playing the piano while I was reading it. He was scoring it <laughs> while she was dreaming about space, and obviously ended up being the first black woman to go to space and. That was just an incredibly dope, you know, for him to just get into that world. So, yes, your sister, your cousins. You said you're thinking of your sister who's raising her kids independently for 15 years. Yes. And, and, and to all the women out here who are, you know, just really, really continuing to, to find your dreams. And, and all the women out here helping other people to find their dreams and, and to... to find their way forward, you know, who are changing the world. I think of my beautiful friend, Tamika Mallory, who's so incredible, who just really, you know, spends every day of her life trying to figure out how she can, she can help those who, who are oppressed and those who are, who are unfairly treated. It's, it's, it's really beautiful. The, the, what we have the power to do, you know what I mean? Just simply by being kind, just simply by being who we are, you know what I mean, in our own way. So, so I love it. I love that so much. And I just, I just wanted to hop on and say, you know, I love you. And today and every day, it's not just today. I know we have these special days that come up, but it's not just today. It's every day for every woman um, throughout history who has sacrificed so much so that we can have more and believe in more and know that there's not just one side for us as women. There's, we, we have every side. We are everything and everything is possible. You know what I mean? So, so just think about that and just, just vibing with you. And, and Patty Newman, you saying I'm a single mom and I graduate this May with your doctorate. Woo! That's right, girl. You better kill them. That's what I'm talking about. It's never, there's nothing impossible. You know, uh, what, what's, what do they say about the word impossible? It means I'm possible. I'm possible. So that's what we are. You know what I mean? And I love it. So my, my homegirl Kelly Clarkson was supposed to jump on with me. Unfortunately, our schedules got crazy and I got delayed and then she had to run off. But shout out to Kelly. I wanted to give her all my love as well. She is so special and so dope, just a, such an honest, brilliant soul, a mama, you know, killing her career and just really a, a giving, beautiful person. So big love to Kelly. Next time we'll, we were going to have a little dual Facebook Live moment, but we'll do it again next time. So it's all good. So again, to everybody who's tuned in right now, just, just feel my love. You know, thank you for sharing all these beautiful beautiful women in your life who you want to lift up and maybe continue to lift each other up. As I was saying, you know, there's nothing that we can't do. We deserve everything. We deserve equal pay scale. We deserve the same education as our male counterparts. We deserve every opportunity, you know, as our male counterparts. And I know that, I know that, that, um, you know, that is what we're here striving for. And the more that we push the boundaries, the more that we go farther and farther and show that there is no limit, you know, and the more that we diversify, you know, where we are, we have the seat at every table, you know, and, and we're, and we are incredible. So I just, um, just was feeling some love like always. And, and I just wanted you to know that, that, um, thinking about you. So just sharing a little vibes, good energy. Good feelings. Thank you for checking in. You're a gift. You're magnificent today and every day. Make sure that you go out and, you know, you, you, you just lift up the women that are around you and remind them just how incredible they are and remind them how much they've done for you because that's what I've been thinking about all day. I've been thinking about that. Even, you know, my favorite Nina Simone, she inspired me in so many ways as an artist to be brave and bold, you know. I think that there's so many incredible women that there's that I'd love to mention. So thank you for mentioning yours. And um 
and to your mom who's been fighting ovarian cancer for the last eight years. That's right, the most powerful woman in the world. So I love you. I love you. I love you. Just wanted to check in, keep shining, shining that light. And I'll talk to you soon. All right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> One love.